All right, what's up? We are uh, packing in here. I got one horse in tow with some gear, a lot of food for the horses, with all the snow. Dad's riding up ahead and he's got a pack horse behind him. So we are just getting up in here. We left early this morning. Took us all day to pack in, back in here. And uh, just getting back to where we want to be, where we're going to set up camp. We're almost here. Get to camp, get it set up, and then start hunting. I am hiking up this steep hill and gonna go look off the backside in these basins. So, fingers crossed, we got a bunch of elk just herded up down there, and there's a couple 350 wolves. And, we can uh, get in there and kill them, so. All right, just about made it to the top up here. Gained a little over a thousand feet of elevation. Just caught some, some tracks up here towards the top, so I'm gonna go peek over, see what I can see, see how the view is, and then if I don't turn anything up, just glassing, I'll probably jump on these tracks. It looks like I'm about a day behind them but at least kind of see the direction they're headed and then glow glass in that area. So that's the benefit of hunting in snow. But um, The one track, there's two tracks right here. It looked like a little smaller. And then the one down there looked like a, a big, big bull. So we're about to find out. Made it to the top. Dropped off the back, just following some tracks. There's a big flat spot where I thought maybe some elk were maybe in a bed and nothing, lots of tracks. So picked the freshest one, the biggest one, started following it. Led me all the way up down the bottom of the draw on the other side, up the face on the other side, and uh, just kept going, so. Stopped over here, I've been glassing the opposite side that I started hiking on all day. Haven't turned anything up, so. Uh, pretty uneventful day. Didn't see anything alive. Not a deer, not a cow, not a doe, not a nothing. So, pretty rough, but there's obviously elk in here. Um, lots of tracks, lots and lots of tracks, so. Just a matter of time before we turn up a big bull, so. We made it up here to the top. We, uh, dad cut, cut some tracks yesterday. Looked like a nice bull, so. Nice bull track, so. We followed it up here yesterday and it looks really good back in this basin, so. We decided to come up here again today and just glass. A lot of timber in this basin, so. It's going to be tough to find him. Man, what a rough few days. We finally found something. We've been in here, this is day three, end of day three, and haven't found any deer or elk. Just turned up two five points. One's a small one, and the other one looks like a pretty nice one. They're like three miles away. It's gonna be tough to try and find them tomorrow. Uh, it's real thick, it's a thick burn with some timber in there, so it's gonna be tough to find it. Tomorrow's our, pretty much our last hunting day. The next day we gotta pack up and and get out of here so end of the day i'm gonna it's getting cold i'm gonna pack up and hike down to camp get a good meal because tomorrow is probably gonna be a long day hiking and hopefully packing meat
that's a solid ball, man. He's just to the left. He went to the left about 20, 30 yards. He's turning to the right. I'm gonna put one in his neck. Okay. Right now. That's a solid bull, bud. That's a nice bull. That's a really nice bull. That's a nice bull. Real nice bull. Nice work. Congrats. That's, That's a great spot. bull. That's great a good bull. Spot. Oh, I saw it was frame. Well, I, what? Saw, I saw six on one side. I'm like, yep, he's yep. good enough. Yep. <laughs> he's good enough. I can't, can't believe you just stood up there. Just, yeah, no, just take me home. Him. Just a few times. <laughs> Finally got steady enough. Poof. The second two were a little bit eh. <laughs> but the first one was good. The last one was good. Yeah, that, yeah. Yeah, oh, man. Yeah, you dumped him on that one. Yeah, that was a great shot. That was awesome. <laughs> saw was six on one side and looked like a good frame so I'm pumped with them any either way and the fact that we were able to get it done today pretty sweet oh. <laughs> nice shot Finally saw some last night, so we started sneaking in here this morning. And it's funny how it works out. We just popped up in the right spot, came over and jumped these bulls out of their beds, and then started tracking them. It was nice and quiet. We could sneak in here and started creeping in. And then Josh spotted this bull standing up here on the ridge. He just made his way through the burn and stopped up on the ridge. Ranged him at 360, got a good rest, and first shot was good. The last one. He was quartered away. He, he was actually almost straight away and then he turned his head to the right and I could see his neck. I was like, I'm just gonna put one in his neck and finish him off and that dumped him right here. So pretty, pretty freaking cool. This is our really our last hunting day. We got a long pack out of here tomorrow. So we've got to pack up camp and do all that. Super blessed. It's awesome. Meat's loaded up. I got front quarters boned out, back strap, all the loose meat, except for one back strap, and that's still back there. We're heading down to the main trail, and then I'll have to come back for load number two. Oh no. I think it's gonna be hitting me in the head. Maybe not once it's hanging. Yeah, that's gonna be riding right on my neck. Just settled it nice. Ain't too bad. I, uh, we just got back up here. We took the first load down to the bottom of the, this hill, down to the big drainage. We've still got a long ways to pack out, but did it pretty, didn't take too long. Back up here, this is the last load. Josh has taken both hind quarters, and now we got the rest right here. Back strap, it's kitchen, catching the, Hitchhike too. Alright, we got the last load out. We uh, just dropped that off, stashed it, and we're hiking back to camp now. We got a few miles to get back to camp, and then um, we're gonna load up camp tomorrow morning, hit the road, we'll pick this up on the, on the way. So, working out perfect. We got the 
uh, trail boss here from the Aging Asian Outfitters. He's been working on that mustache for a couple School of years. Boys. We're all loaded up. Got all the camp packed up. And uh, we're heading out. It's about noon. It took us a while to pack up camp, but we're on the trail. And uh, on the way out, we're gonna swing by, pick up my bull, throw him on, and keep on trekking, get all the way out of here. Uh, it's been a pretty awesome trip. Two bulls and uh, lots of good memories, so that's what it's all about.